We have more details tonight on a program designed to help people facing homelessness that's now back up and running. WMBF News reporter Natasha Lagarde joins us live now from the Myrtle Beach Municipal Court. So Natasha, can you explain what is Homeless Court and how can it help people right here in our community? Well, Rachel, the program aims to help those that are facing misdemeanor charges to start with a clean slate. Now, staff from New Direction tells me that this program has been very helpful for those who are facing homelessness. I'm pretty excited that we're getting ready to start it up again. I think it's been very successful across the country. For years, Chief Officer for New Directions, Kathy Jenkins, has seen many people experiencing homelessness come through these doors. She has a passion to help those in need. We are always looking for um, different partnerships and different resources so that we can help our clients in any way that they need help. Jenkins sees clients struggle with a variety of things like mental health, transportation, and legal issues. A reinstated program could help with everything Jenkins sees. We're not interested in just putting them in jail. That's not solving their problem or ours. After a nearly three year pause due to COVID-19, Homeless Court is back. To help them battle and, and work through their legal issues, I think it's a great opportunity for them. They're, they're already on the road to self-sufficiency. Chief Judge Joy Page will oversee all the Homeless Court sessions. The program aims to help those facing misdemeanor charges get a second chance. Page can expunge charges from participants' records. We become a support for them and an encouragement for them rather than uh, creating more stress, more problem, more fear. The only catch is that the court is strictly voluntary. Once a candidate qualifies for the program, they will have to choose whether they want to participate and get the resources needed for change. The next court sections will take place here at Myrtle Beach Municipal Court, but the next future ones could take place at New Directions. Live in Myrtle Beach, Natasha Lager, WMBF News.